They all lived happily, happily, happily ever after. The couple is happily leaving the chapel eternally tied. As the curtain descends, there is nothing but loving and laughter. When the fairy tale ends, the heroine's always a bride. Ella, the girl of the cinders, did the wash and the walls and the windows. But she landed a prince who was brawny and blue-eyed and blonde. Still, I honestly doubt that she could ever have done it without that crazy lady with the wand. Cinderella had outside help. I have no one but me. Fairy godmother, 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 where can you be? I haven't got a fairy godmother. I haven't even got a godmother. I've got a mother, a plain, ordinary woman, who's completely barky, bless her. Snow White was so pretty, they tell us, that the queen was insulted and jealous when the mirror declared that Snow White was the fairest of all. She was dumped on the border, but was saved by some men who adored her. Oh, I grant you. They were small, but there were seven of them, practically a regiment. I'm alone in the night, by myself, not a dwarf, not an elf, not a goblin inside. That girl had seven determined little men working for her day and night. Oh, sure, the queen gave her a poisoned apple, but even so... She lived happily, happily, happily ever after. A magical kiss counter acted the apple eventually. Though I know I'm not clever, I'll do what they tell me I have to. I want some happily ever after to happen to me. Rapunzel had platinum tresses that were double the length of her dresses. She was kept in a tower for years by a wicked old witch. So one night in despair down, she scrambled by letting her hair down. That's what I call quite a switch. I wonder. No, it'd never hold. It'd bloody hurt. I'd be finished before I begin. And besides, I don't want to get out.